Okay, uh, everyone's favorite topic to talk about. Corporate greed. <sighs> Finish my tea. Corporate greed. Today, corporate consolidation is allowing companies to keep racking in historical profits um, while continuing to like rise uh, prices for working families. In the two decades uh, before President Biden came to office, three quarters of the American industries so grew um, and more concentrated. That's just capitalism as well. Too. It will always do that. Yeah, as the president often say, capitalism without competition is capitalism. Is he saying that capitalism is a good thing? Of course he is. He's a capitalist too. And I don't know what he means by capitalism. Uh, it's exploitation. Capitalism is exploitation. That's what they don't understand. And the American people were tired of being like played for suckers. We are the 99%. The, it, it, there's always going to be a minority of people that are owners. And the majority of people will be workers, even though maybe opportunity for like uh, some people to be like owners, and it, yeah, probably could be anyone that could be an owner as well too, but not everyone can be an owner. Not everyone can succeed, and so thus, there are many people that are forever be workers, and thus will be exploited by being a worker. That's why I'm not in favor of capitalism in any form. Continue. The administration has taken historical steps to boost competition across our economy in the fields of like, finance, farming, to technologies, and transportation. Can I pause and say why the hell there needs to be like a competition or interest in finance? I digress. No. Uh, we're banning non compete agreements so that the workers have a freedom to pursue like, new jobs and start new business. We're protecting consumers from unfair hidden junk fees and price gouges and like shoring up like a banking system to keep people's hard earned savings uh, safe. Isn't that. But then why was it that like, T Mobile was able to like buy out Sprint? I was on Sprint's like, network and then like Team and Sprint became part of Team Mobile. And so now it's pretty much like T-Mobile and Network and or Verizon Network. That's it in the USA. So those are the only things that you can have like a access for in terms of like a cell phone networks. Uh, I think it maybe AT and T is still around. I don't know. Anyway, uh, during the first his first month in office, the president launched a competition called the uh, Council Task with like coordinating with this events work. Agencies have taken dozens of actions to increase the competition across markets and industries, um, from making hearing aids available over the counter to reducing cargo and rail and, and, and rail shipping and costs for goods. To support efforts to like to allow farmers and other Americans to repair their own equipment. Again, that was a huge that's a huge thing and that's a problem as well too because the subscription model. Of things kind of like how like you if you buy like adobe premiere or like adobe premiere suite of programs well too you don't own uh adobe premiere and those kind of like the suite of programs what you own instead is the and what you own instead is a license to that like software and then like you have to renew that license every year much like if anyone that owns like a Windows like a PC or Windows operated PC, um, it is Microsoft is always trying to like get people to buy Microsoft Office again. They want to buy. They have they're selling people the Microsoft Office subscription, not necessarily the programs as well too, but subscription. And because you have to like um, renew the subscription each year to continue the getting the updates for like Microsoft Office and then getting access to like um, services, that's extended to like John Deere and their tractors, and their tractors because the like, tractors have like GPS devices as well too. And my company used to like make the LCD displays for them as well too. So we sometimes do, but we don't make it as often as we do. Um, and by making and and. and, and if uh, you allow the companies to do so, it, then like uh, farmers cannot be able to repair their own tractors because like of how like no, that's like the, you only own the subscription to like that tractor, basically. So yeah, right to repair is like very big and important, honestly. 
Uh, continue on. The Justice Department and the FTC has an increased antitrust enforcement, uh, releasing updates m mergers guidelines, and like halting a slate of big mergers in airline food defense uh, sectors that would have increased consumer prices. Democrats will keep, keep working. I, I think we should uh, get rid of prices altogether, but like the Democrats don't want to be communists, even though they have been slammed for being communists all the time. Continue on. Democrats will keep working to like make the American economy more competitive for businesses and uh, workers uh, across sectors, from transportation to housing to food, and we will and we will you know, reform uh, hiring and procurement uh, processes across the government to boost competition amongst our uh, contractors and suppliers too. The administration is also like taking broad action to crack down on junk fees, the hidden charges that companies uh, add to like people's bills without their knowledge, <coughs> reducing consumer choice. We are already taking action to crack down on a range of these junk fees charged by airlines and the providers, hotels, and apartment buildings. We, we, I mean, it's like they just can like set fees and something like that. They say it's a fee for this and like charge as well too. Banks also do that. We pushed like uh, banks to slash unfair overdraft and balance checks uh, charges to take action to uh, cap credit cards like fees. Just get rid of the idea of uh, overdraft fee. Just get rid of that. Overdraft fee, I, I, I'm a part of a credit union, and then still I can get hit by overdraft fees because I mistakenly did not realize I was going to have like money in that account by this time. Overdraft, especially since like you can, the, the, comp, the banks make millions of dollars each year, multi millions of dollars each year over overdraft fees. And what are overdraft fees, fees and charges for you being too poor? And how they expect the, like the poor people that like, end up with zero money in their checking account to pay for the overdraft fees. <sighs> Just get rid of the concept of overdraft fees or balance checks and that sort of thing too. Good night. We're cracking down on junk health insurance ponds that advise one rate, but then like sick patients with a much bigger rate than medical bills. Over time, this combined, these combined actions will save American families hundreds and even thousands of dollars a year, adding up to like, more than $20 billion a year across the economy, hey, giving people a little more briefing room, and we'll keep pushing until we ban all junk fees across the economy. How about you run the healthcare system yourself then? But you won't. You don't want to. You want to leave the market as it is. Um, don't want to change the market, which is creating these crises. Just don't want to leave the market as it is and just like make it more tolerable for people. Anyway, continue on. Democrats will also like work to shore up like a safe, secure banking system that protects like consumer deposits and hold investors accountable. So Democrats have like pushed for legislation to like hold executives at all failed banks accountable, uh, clawing back uh, in a comprehensive and uh, banning them from like the industry. We're working to limit out control like Wall Street bonuses that like in encourage like a risky bank practices that jeopardize our whole economy. Yep, Wall Street is your donors too. A lot of the don a lot of those people who create that financial crash in like Wall Street in two thousand eight and so on and so forth are still your donors. They're still some of your major donors. It is like uh, Biden said to Wall Street in twenty twenty. I will keep on bringing it up as as long as it keeps continuing being relevant. Well, Biden said to Wall Street, nothing's going to fundamentally change. And so I doubt that like uh, things are going to like change like the as the Democrats are saying. We will keep pushing to like pass a updated Glass Steagall uh, Act and more like uh, clearly separating commercial and, and investment banking and and expanding Volcker's rules uh, safeguards. Uh, we defeated the Republican efforts to gut the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau at the Supreme Court this year, and will continue to protect and strengthen that agency as a force for crit uh, critical work. The words have spoken both right wing and left wing support of capitalism. It's the rare thing that we agree on on why we have owners, Errors, and they won't get like rid of their money. Mm -hmm. Um, hey, which is why I'm not in favor of capitalism. It creates this kind of system as well too. Housing. Uh.